Okay, on this video, I'm just going to go through the assembly of all these different parts onto the do more. In fact, I'll even slide it down here a little ways so you can see on video a little bit more clearly. Just always remember, the do more is going to have electricity to run the motor. It's got to. So now, what we want to do is we actually want to install this four inch do more grinder wheel. I've already highlighted ours. You go down to here where it says belt length, you want a 22 inch belt, four inch wheel, maximum. You want to put a number three pulley on the spindle. Now remember, this is the spindle, and this is the motor. Always remember that the motor spindle is left hand. It's a special nut. They look identical to the other nuts, identical. So always keep them apart. Try to always take the spindle nuts off first and install what you need on both sides whether it's going to be for your wheel on this side or your pulley on this side and then when you get the spindle side complete then go to your motor side and do the one that's left hand you go over to your pulleys and you find the one mark number three put that one on your spindle side take your right hand thread nut and tighten it up. Now, what else does it call for? We got a four inch grinding wheel. So you put your grinding wheel on the other side. Just big washer. It does have a cutout. That way the outside edge is the only thing that actually bonds to the wheel. It gives a better surface finish hole. Right hand nut and Install it on the other side. Now, take, you want to tighten both of these nuts up. This do more grinder comes with one wrench that fits this nut, so you'll have to use an adjustable wrench and tighten up. Not dog tight, but just tighten up to where you know it's on there snug. So we said the other one was going to be a number one on the manual, number one on the motor. But there's only one nut. So it comes with another wrench that actually locks in to the end of the shaft for the motor. Take the first do more wrench and tighten up the pulley nut. And now you've got that locked in place. Also called for a belt number of 429-0086. Remember, you have two different pulleys that you got to go by. See the difference? The 86 is longer. We'll take 86, put over the pulley system, the motor, it's tensioned, put it over the edge of the motor just as so. Now I showed you how to put all of this on. Now I know what you're saying. You said you forgot the grinding wheel cover. You're right. I installed everything so you can see how it went together here. Now, I will uninstall the wheel. I'll install this. All this slides over your, your spindle and you have two screws that tighten it up and clamps it over top of your spindle. Then I'll reinstall the wheel and we'll put it on the lathe and show you how to install it on the lathe.